We're back with former Biggest Loser finalist Rob Guyrie. Now we're going to do an easy ab workout to get us ready for the beach this summer. Dr. Laura Kristoff is joining in on the fun. She's a professor of nutrition. She's also a certified personal trainer. So here we are. I'm here with the certified personal trainer and the finalist on the Biggest Loser. I hope I can keep up, you guys. <laughs> I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay, this is, we'll uh, see. This is a really easy workout. You know, now that I'm home, kind of like creating our, my own workout routine, trying to figure out something that's sustainable, I try to do some sort of ab or core work with every single one of my workouts. You know, you, uh, your abdominals, your core, that's really what uh, strengthens you and, and gives you sort of that uh, athletic disposition to, to move faster, do different things. Uh, so I try to incorporate that every day. Uh, this workout is just four quick exercises, quick uh, ab exercises. They target sort of every area of your abdominals. Uh, it can be catered to your own ability levels. So mm -hmm. there's different variations on these that could be easier or harder depending on, um, you know, your own ability level. Yeah. And uh, it should work for everybody. Very cool. Now, this is something that you take, you're incorporating what you've learned on the ranch and putting Absolutely. it into your daily life. Now, Dr. Kristoff, you teach group fitness classes, you teach spinning, mm -hmm. and so you're always in the in the gym. I am. Always. So. Always. <laughs> but this is a way that you could do something at home in your living room. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, so what are we doing, Rob? How are we going to start? All right, so like I said, the, there are four main exercises. I rotate through this four times each, so four exercises by uh by four reps. And as always, warm up before you work out, but oh, we yeah. already did. We're make, already Make sure we're you're ready. nice and limber. <laughs> um, so the first one is just like your standard crunch, right? I call it uh, like like a three direction crunch. It's kind of like a bicycle crunch, Okay. but you're doing a regular crunch in between. All right, I'm gonna face you this way. Sounds good. Um, so, you know, in a crunch, you're bringing your opposite elbow to your knee. Yep. Right, so it's one, Two and then you come up okay. to the front. So is this something Dolvet taught you? No, this is something I made up in my mom's basement when I was working <laughs> out one day. So that's that's one, two, three. Okay, that's so really easy. One, two, three. Exactly. Okay, and uh, crunches are good for you, right, Dr. Kristoff? Mm -hmm. Those are good for your tummy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's it's sort of like the the base uh, abdominal workout, and and you can build from there. Right on. Um, What's next? So after that we have like this is a, a varied leg lift. Um, so for a leg lift, you want to keep your feet uh, roughly two to three inches off the ground, oh, right? Oh, yep. Yeah, you can really feel it I'm in your shaking. lower abs. Yeah. So you hold it there for five seconds. Okay. Right. You count it out: one, two, three, four, five. Then you bring your legs up to ninety degrees. Yeah. And then mm -hmm. you try to lift your lower back off the floor, oh. just utilizing your your abs and your core. So you keep your arms down, and you push your butt up, and you do that ten times. Okay. Right. So ten variations. I'm of feeling that. the burn already. Right. It's a really okay. deep burn. Okay. It is. It is deep burn. Right. Um, okay. So the, the next exercise is called a, a side jackknife. Okay. And that sounds really scary. It sounds scary, but it's actually pretty easy. You get into like supermodel <laughs> pose, scary. right, with your your elbow down. Wait, what you call this? I call this supermodel pose. I feel like mm -hmm. I'm I'm on the beach in. <laughs> In Bermuda. Uh, oh, I'm not ready for that, okay? I, I need to work out a lot. That's more. why we're doing this to, to get ready for bikini season. Ready for Bermuda. Right, and you put your uh, your hand behind your head, right? Yeah. You're, you're totally cheesing it. And basically, what you want to do is you want to lift your leg and bring your elbow to your knee. Okay. So it's all at once. Oh, yeah. You really, you really can feel it in the, uh, yeah, feel in the like side there. Jane Fonda. Yeah. Right, and you yeah. want to do that 15, uh, 15 times uh, on each side. All right. And then the last one, Whew. it's uh, becoming more and more common. There's a bunch of variations on it. It's just your standard plank. Yes, yeah, so plank. Mm -hmm. Now, this is something that is, look, it looks so simple, but it's really like a whole body workout, right? Absolutely. This is, a, this is like an isometric workout, uh, which means like you're not, you're not moving. You don't, if you looked at it, you'd say, well, what are you doing? But you're essentially clenching all of your muscles at the same time in order to stay up, and it, it really benefits your whole body. Okay. So we're going to do it now? Yeah. And this uh, is on our forearms? Yep. So you go down on your forearms and your toes. You want to make sure your butt isn't too high in the air, right? You want a, a straight line from the top of your head to the base of your spine. And you're essentially holding it here. Um, you could do 30 seconds, 45 seconds, a minute. You could lift one arm up. You could lift your legs up. There are a bunch of different variations to make it harder make or it easier, harder. Now, depending on your own ability. Dr. Right? Christoph, so how can we do a, pose. the supermodel yeah, pose? Right, absolutely. That's when you, you graduate to the, the plank right, supermodel right. pose. Uh, what are, what's a way that you could modify this, Dr. Christoph, if you're not, if you are a, like a real beginner and this is really hard for you? So you could go up 
on your hands, you know, okay. especially if you, you know, if your elbows are hurting or if you just start to feel like you're coming up like this or going down Which like that. Which is bad form. Yeah, you could also go on your knees, you Absolutely. know, and hold on your knees there. You just really want to make sure you're but squeeze tight and your abs are nice and locked in. Right, too. so it's not just doing it, it's doing it right. Yeah. Oh, 100%. Because you could do the plank. Listen to me, I'm out of breath. Uh, you <laughs> can do the, the plank, but you have to be making sure that you're engaging all those muscles to get the right workout. Absolutely. All right, you guys, you're rock stars. Let's keep working out. Okay, what, you want to do the plank? Yeah, let's or, do a plank. Or supermodel? What do, do, what do you really want to work here? Supermodel plank. Supermodel plank. Supermodel plank. <laughs> we'll do one right now. Okay, you guys keep going. So we just worked out. No, keep going. Get down there. We, <laughs> we just worked out. When we return, we're going to tell you.